guys so it's 8 a.m right now we're about to make a trip out to connecticut for all you halo fans out there we have a special one we are linking up with the owner and a player of a very notorious halo org I'm not going to say the name just yet and we're going to be delivering this pc to the player and there's also a trophy being delivered which is a little hint so you know i'm changing the colors right now to match the theme and we're going to get on our way we have a two-hour drive to Connecticut and I'm excited you know we love Halo here at Paradox Customs I personally love Halo and 2023 we're gonna keep bringing some Halo love back into the mix so let's get to it so in case you guys can't tell now it's for status quo we're working with my guy Mike Flame Sword, owner of Status Quo, and we're giving this PC to Bop. He won the free for all at Worlds. He's a world champion and he deserves a PC worthy of one. He's out of commission right now on a setup, so we are hooking him up with this rig and we are hoping to continue a great relationship with Status Quo and support them in their growth into Halo. So let's get it. Yo, so the FPS is fire. After optimizing it, we're getting around 200 consistent FPS at 1440p. And I'm sure everyone on Halo um, plays at 1080p, or well, I could be wrong. So it's gonna get even more, like 240. So we haven't tested Halo FPS in quite a while. So after our full overclock and optimization, it's good to see still some high consistent FPS. So I'm pretty happy, yo. I'm excited. It's gonna be plug and play when we get there. And I'm gonna show them this FPS as well. Ready to roll, let's get it. We're gonna drive to Connecticut. We're gonna surprise him. I don't know if he knows. He probably has some idea. We're gonna stop by his house and we're gonna set it up for him and we're gonna have a great time. You know, I wanna learn more about this guy, Bop. Let's go. All right, guys, so we're on the way and it's time to talk about our relationship with Halo. So in case you guys don't know, the BR and BR paradox stands for battle rifle. And that's because I made it when I was destroying kids in Halo 3. We call it the battle rifle paradox, as in you couldn't figure out how I was this good. So corny stuff aside, Halo is my true background. You know, I came from Halo. I've been playing since Halo 1. Then I started playing a lot more in Halo 2 and then I devoted my whole life to Halo 3 and Halo Reach. And that's where um, this all came in. This project is so important to me because the person and the org we're delivering to is someone and something that I've always admired. You know, when Halo Reach, this org was so huge, same as Halo 3, and I've, they've had some incredible, incredible players. They have some new players nowadays, but the org is coming for that revival and I'm very gladly down to support them. One of my favorite memories of Status Quo was uh, them winning one of the championships in Halo Reach, MLG Dallas 2011. I remember watching that event, getting so hyped when they won. And you know, it was with the same team that Status Quo was running with the whole year, the whole game. It was Flame Sword, Enable, Assault, and Ace. And those are all incredible, incredible players. They had a solid team and it was great to see them finally pull off the W. Now, looking through, you know, online, it does look very impressive how active Status Quo has been. You know, they kept going and then they came back recently, you know, and they've been very active ever since. So I'm eager to see what 2023 holds for Halo Esports, but, you know, Status Quo definitely has my support in any events going on. I'm so excited to meet Flame Sword. This might be my first time meeting him. So yeah, you know, let's meet up and uh, we're gonna get some insider scoop there too. We're gonna ask them a lot of questions and uh, feel them out and just have a good time, you know, uh, embrace our Halo uh, roots and also talk about Halo Infinite on the PC, uh, what it means to him and the rest is history. So let's uh, get going. Doing. 
doing, bro? It's a pleasure. I'm excited. Got you guys some merch. Okay. Uh, we just had a drop, you know, like Rich and Lonely. We, and yeah. Those. Yeah, so we, we did a collab with them. Yeah, bro, we got the good stuff, you know what I mean? Oh yeah. The crack. I got you guys both the t-shirt and the hoodie. Let's go, man. I appreciate that. Let's get it. Big pop. Yo. What's going on, dude? It's a pleasure. Oh man. Nice to meet you, man. Congratulations, man. So yeah, we this we did it. We had our drop from Rich and Lonely. So um. So we'll show you the the battleground where he goes to war every day. That. Oh, that's beautiful. That's the trophy right there. Woo. Free for all champion at Worlds 2022, baby. Dude, what I was like, this guy is just dumping the computer out the box. That's how you gotta do it. People no. are always trying to pick it up and break in the car. I, yeah, I pick it up for sure. People like, I know that trick. That's you wanna know what you can do for the hill community? Put that video out. Oh yeah. How to, that... how to take the PC out of the box. I'll vouch for Mike, yo, like you are an amazing person for doing this and like actually like staying on top of this project and looking out for you, like, you know, you're the fucking man, dude. Yeah, so this one has a Ryzen 9 uh, 5900X, which is a 12 core. Yeah. Um, it's a beast. Uh, as far as the difference, it's really not much difference. It just depends on the tier, what RAM you pair with it. Okay. Like the competitor to this was the i9 12900K, okay. which was like plagued with issues, right? And yeah. this was like the go-to CPU. Now the new ones are out, but like, you know, those yeah. are also somewhat of a marginal difference. But um, again, I think the FPS you're gonna get in Halo is like so much. Three fans in the front, we got, uh, and then three fans, like two in the top, one in the rear. And uh, let me show you guys the theme that we have. So we got the yeah. nice status quo logo on oh, it. Hey. We got the we got you the best RAM too, 3600 megahertz CL14. Uh, we have the Asus X570-E Wi-Fi 2, which is a beautiful board. Mm -hmm. uh, the Gigabyte RTX 3070 Ti. Yeah. Um, and we have the NZXT Kraken G73, and we also have a two terabyte SSD too, which is great okay. in case you need to store a lot of videos or games and all that. So these are like the best settings for uh, like the best FPS and like the competitive settings. So pretty much just like low everything. And then at the end, um, you just wanna make sure like pretty much all these sliders are uh, turned off to zero and the sharpen can stay at 60. So how'd you get the name Bob? Oh man, this is crazy. How uh, did you? Uh, <laughs> so I went through like a couple names, went like through uh, two names. I'm Hispanic. My, my like console name was like Poppy, but nobody wanted to call me that. <laughs> so I just put a B in it. So it was just Bobby, right? So it was B-O-P-P-Y. Cause like, you know, whatever, right? B, just put a B in front of it instead of a P. And then, you know, like during the Fortnite era, like, you know, Daquan, right? Yeah, yeah. He was saying that a lot. Like Boppy like, or? No, Bobby? just Bop. Oh, And oh. I was like, damn, like, that's pretty, you know, short. Ooh, yeah. It's Bop, like, Bop yeah. somebody in the head, or <laughs> you hit a snipe, it's like, Bop. Bop. <laughs> you know that? Oh, they do. Oh, my God. That's about them. Oh, you're already crouching faster. <laughs> you oh. got the hacks, bro. We're getting like 270 FPS right now. Wow. Wow. That's, that's important. First game, a dub. <laughs> oh, um, yeah, I was nah, that's good. lit. It was, it was like 270, 280 when I was playing. And that's, that's a bigger map than like what we normally play. So yeah, like, it's definitely gonna be like consistent, like in the arena. Oh, Ben, first year at Halo, 
being a FFA world champion, it's crazy. It, it didn't sink in until like just recently because I, I just couldn't believe it. But like, I'm really, I'm really happy and excited. What it's like to have a new PC? I'm just happy. It's a beast and I can't wait to grind for the new season. All right guys, and that's gonna be a wrap. We've successfully set up your PC. Everything's looking good. How are you feeling right now? I'm feeling great. I'm happy. I appreciate you for surprising me early in the morning. So yeah, thank you, man. I got you. Next time I'll pull up at night. <laughs> <laughs> How are you feeling, Mike? Man, I'm excited. Uh, I know he's probably trying to stay a humble beast right now, but he's probably like, I need y'all to get out. I finally got a PC. I'm ready to game. How many hours can I get in before my one o'clock appointment? Y'all got to go on some MTV crib stuff, probably. <laughs> but nah, a huge shout out to Paradox Customs, man. Just unbelievable from when we connected with our story in the beginning of the year to know that everything started in Halo, man, to now the next generation I'm excited to, to see where the legacy goes absolutely and we're here to support you guys um and support status quo and this was just the first of many content slash projects that we're gonna do thank you so much mike for um making all this happen bringing us out here again like you got anything you want to say last chance again thank you to you all uh the audience i mean just like my dreams coming true every single day with status quo i mean i'm sure you get to see it day in and day out obviously gaming's huge but from what you and i have talked about i mean there's so much lifestyle that you bring to the table so to be able to see you guys just continue going through different cultures different sectors within the industry is just amazing and to, to borrow you and actually have you meet up with us and have the time man absolutely amazing so big shout out to you all at paradox customs big shout out to you man and i'm just excited for the kid to finally be back on the sticks you know what i'm saying my man nah it's love bro i the same goes for you man this is not the end this is only the beginning 100 so percent. i like that you guys just stay tuned and bot congratulations our ffa champion please make some noise what do I have to say for everybody on console? Switch, man. Switch to PC, you know, even if it's just an entry level, switch to PC, and it's just a big difference. Your gameplay will just skyrocket just off of that alone.